The term TBIs, we, we've kind of talked about, it means traumatic brain injury. A lot of folks just use the term TBI for these moderate and severe ones. The moderate traumatic brain injury um, is one where there, there often is bleeding inside the brain. It's, it's what's called diffuse or it's in multiple places and it tends to be a small amount scattered around the brain. You don't typically have large areas of bleeding. Uh, if you look at the, an x-ray, a CT scan or MRI, you don't often see just big, big areas of bleeding. You may see little multiple areas. You typically have confusion of thought and speech for hours, sometimes days. So you don't just snap out of it in 10 minutes or even six hours. Usually you've got 24 hours or more of just confused thinking. And often you don't remember that period of time. It's called post-traumatic amnesia. You're not building new memories. You're forgetful about what's just happening right around the injury. Uh, along with that, you're going to not really be able to do routine things easily. You might not be able to dress yourself uh, in a normal way. You certainly shouldn't be driving a car. We have this period of time of confusion. We'll also usually have problems with overall balance and coordination. So we can't necessarily easily walk or move up and down and twist and turn. You'll have pretty good strength, but you're gonna be discoordinated. So you can't use your arms and legs in a normal way, and you may not be able to speak in a normal way or even swallow food in a normal way. But so it's this kind of global or overall difficulty in a moderate level that's called a moderate traumatic brain injury. Good news is most people rapidly, within weeks at the latest, get through that period of time. All right, they, they sometimes within a couple of days, they're up and walking around and kind of look fully normal, but their thinking's a little confused. Their memory isn't consistent yet. They may not have that amnesia, so they kind of know where they are roughly, but they're easily distractible. You're gonna really not be able to focus well. You may wanna kind of not listen to what people are telling you. If you're in the hospital still, they may have to kind of say, get back into the chair. You're, you're kind of, you're not safe to be up and around and let me help you get around. Typically people look very good. Back to what, what you can almost call normal by four weeks, if not quicker. And then by three months, we don't really find many problems at all, except with very, very sophisticated imaging equipment or very high level thinking tests.